Hello guys, so this is Mark here and today I just wanted to show you some of the new features of the new SBB Mobile Shell that's version 3.5 uh, release in later, late September this year. Uh, as you can see here, like the interface is quite great and finger friendly. You can slide your finger like this across the screen and just flips to another page. And you can do this to the other side too. So here you can see like a Google search toolbar, the, the clock and uh, some other info. I can click into it and uh, that's a weather forecast of my um, local city. That's for Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. And also it's got the uh, temperature forecast for the night, morning, day and evening. And one of the updates in SBB Mobile Shell 3.5 is that uh, you can choose uh, um, when you want to update the weather forecast. The settings is right here. Um, settings. See how it says update weather forecasts only in free connections that's one of the major changes uh, for the weather function in SBB Mobile Shell 3.5 prior to that you can just choose um, how often to update it like once every few hours or every 24 hours or whatever um, so that's the weather feature uh, I'll show you agenda feature or well, like this you'd see a calendar view and if you just click into it um, this is a mini calendar right here and uh, I'll minimize it and here's the weather forecast again and the date and if, if you got like an appointment or something to do on that day it would show up like hey like you got something to do at five o'clock in the afternoon and also <coughs> what you got to do like um, you got a meeting with someone or something and the location where you're going to do it so that's the agenda feature uh, also there's the contact uh, SBB mobile shell these are the favorite contacts you can save it for people that you call most often and the button right here is for the full list of all your contacts and uh, it's pretty much the same so nothing special um, one of the things really remarkable about this version update is that it's really a battery saver prior to its installation of this app um, my, ba my battery pack lasts just two days and using SP Mobile Shell 3.5 uh, lasts about three and a half days out so that's something really great uh, as you can see like the interface is rather finger friendly I can just uh, screw up with my fingers uh, just, just almost like using an iPhone yeah if I just go like this switches to the start menu yeah. so for those with SBB mobile shell version 3.0 this is a free update you simply have to enter the same serial number that you had for your um, 3.0 version um, for people who have SBB mobile shell version 2.0 there's an update fee but I really think it's worth it thanks for watching